the, the characters that you guys play, was there any character traits or personality traits that you guys felt like you guys could empathize with or relate to? Red? <laughs> I just talked for a while, so. Um, yeah, that was a good question. Good question. That's, that's, that's like essential to just the work, you know, that's putting the hay in the barn right there. Uh, that's the first thing I do anyway when I get a script is find out um, different attributes of the character and how I could relate. Uh, with this guy in particular, um, I just really liked how he was, he was fighting for something. He had, he, had a, he had a passion. It wasn't necessarily just for, you know, the love, which he clearly has for the woman. You know, he's like this gorgeous woman on screen, and you can see that's conveyed, and it's like, that's the kid. But it wasn't just all, you know, bravado, Rico Suave, that, that He also was a passionate person. Um, you saw that in his work, you know, as, a, as an attorney, he's fighting for a cause. So he, he had, I think that's important to mention, to have something that you're really fighting for. Um, and then he had this this uh, routine where you could see where he would, you know, like even when he's working out or jogging, whether, whether he's upset, whether it's just a, he was, he was a man that kind of, he built a structure for, for himself and the way he lives his life. And uh, I kind of like that. And I, I gravitated towards that. Yeah, I, I think I gravitated towards, um, towards Janae's sort of pain, not that I, myself, Deborah Joy was in pain, but I think I have a heart for women that struggle to get up again, that mm. struggle to sort of get out of their own way. And even though they've been hurt and they've been betrayed to still see the brighter side of life and, um, and be open. And um, I, that touched me about her. And so um, that's just, that's, I always want to see, I want to see us win in every way, not just in a career, but, but in life, the older you get, you realize life is about relationships. Life is about the daily choices and decisions that you make every single day. Uh, that's what life is. And when someone can't, or they're in a place where they're unable to keep making decisions that will make their day brighter and happier and get them closer to the goals and the dreams that they have. It's, you know, I empathize with that. It's, it's hard. And so um, I'm happy that I was able to put myself in that place and see, you know, what it sort of felt like and how, how do we move forward? How do we open up? How do we create that space for love and, um, and second chances?